That certified most accurate forecast has a lot of rain chances in it, but we're not looking at widespread rain that is going to push you in the house all day long. We're actually just looking at 30% chance of spotty showers today, tomorrow, even less. Now those rain chances will be increasing. That forecast will get a little bit more active as we head into the new week, but to finish the weekend and to start that work week, things aren't going to be too bad. We got a little light shower activity right now off the coast and that activity will stay off the coast. But as that sea breeze continues to push into our area, that activity is going to push into the area as well. And the humidity is going to push in. It hasn't left, but the temperatures will be a little cooler today. That's the good news for us. The trade off is a little bit more cloud coverage. Right now we're in the low 70s. Baxley and Pembroke 70 right on the dot. If you get to the upper 60s, it'll be the first time in a while. We've been hanging out in that 70 degree range out at the islands, not in the 80s like we have been. You're in the upper 70s as well. Now today we'll see those temperatures, like I said, a little bit cooler. Our average high should be at 92 and we're going to get close to that inland. Every Everybody else a degree or two degrees cooler. Now the rain chances are out there. All that humidity is out there. So if you do have a shower pop up, we have a lot of moisture in the air and it is going to stay feeling irritating and those showers could produce a lot of rain because of how much moisture is out there. Futurecast shows the shower activity staying out at the coast through the mid morning and then you'll have that chance for it as it does continue to push westward. It's not going to be as bad as it was yesterday. Not as many showers as yesterday and tomorrow looking even better. By 10, 11 o'clock, the cloud coverage will break away. And tomorrow afternoon, just a very light chance of those showers popping up. Now that 20% chance that we have tomorrow isn't going to be sticking around. And when we're going to have those rain chances really increasing midweek. The good news with the increase in the rain chances, that means an increase in cloud coverage. And that means a decrease in those temperatures. I wish I could say it was a decrease.